So we've been working on making words mean more than one. And usually we just add an S to words to make it mean more than one. But if a word ends with an S, a Z, an X, the SH digraph, or the CH digraph, we don't just add S, we add ES to show that there are more than one. So we have some words in our word in our word bank and we are going to make it mean more than one by adding ES. So let's see if we can figure out these words. D er s. Dress, that would be one dress. B -n -ch. Bench, that would be one bench. Fox, that would be one fox. Fox rhymes with box, that would be one box. D -ish. Dish, that would be one dish. B -z. Buzz. Okay, so we have to find the word, the base word, and look at the picture that would match the word and then make it mean more than one. So the first sentence, what picture, what do we see in the picture? Yes, we see benches. So here it says, I see two benches. Here's our word bench. So we're going to write the word bench. B, E, N, C, H. I see two bench, is that right? No, we need benches. So we need to add ES to our base word bench to make it two benches. Let's read it again. I see two benches. All right, let's look at our next picture. What do you see? I see boxes too. How many are there? Three. So here our sentence says, there are three boxes. So we have to find our word box and write the word box. Because it ends with an X, we won't just add an S here, we'll add ES to show boxes. Let's read it, it says, there are three boxes. One, two, three, that's right. Let's look at our next picture. What do you see? I see dresses also. The sentence says, she has two dresses. Here's our base word dress. Let's write the word dress, D-R-E-S-S. The word ends with an S, so we're not gonna just add another S. We will add ES. Let's read what it says. She has two dresses. One, two. All right, the picture for number four got cut off a little, but what are these things? Those are dishes, that's right. Let's see what the sentence says. Set the in the sink. Set the dishes in the sink. Very good. Here's our base word dish. Let's write dish. D-I-S-H. Dish ends with that S-H sound, so we're not just going to add an S. We have to add E-S to show there is more than one dish. Let's read the sentence now that it has dishes. Set the dishes in the sink. That's so they can wash them, right? All right, what do we see on number five? Yeah, that looks like a bee. And what does a bee do? It flies. And what noise does it make? It makes a buzzing sound, doesn't it? Let's see what the sentence says. I hear many, we say I hear many, foxes or I hear many buzzes? 
I hear many buzzes. So we're going to write the base word buzz, B, U, Z, Z for buzz. Because it ends with a Z, we won't just add an S, we have to add ES. Let's read the sentence now that it's complete. I hear many buzzes. And our last word is what? Fox. Do you think that those might be foxes? Yeah, I might have guessed dog before, but I see that my last word is fox. So let's see what it says. The two play. Would that make sense? The two foxes play? It would. So let's write our base word fox, F, O, X. Because this word ends with an X, we won't just add an S to show more than one. We have to add E, S to show more than one. Let's read it together. The two foxes play. You did a great job adding E, S to words that ended with S, Z, X, the sh sound, and the ch sound to show there were more than one. Keep it up.